Hello everybody. This is the 21st of April 2020 and it's me again with another journal video which may or may not be well which is not going to be great quality because as we know I'm not a videographer. I don't know how to do any edits or add music unless I just turn music on in the background etc etc. So anyway here is, I'm still on this journal. Not for too much longer, though. Um, I'm starting to run out of room. I've got this many-ish pages, but I'm going to look for a way to either fill all of them up by the end of April to start a new journal on May 1st, or I will just rip the extra pages out. Because after May, I'm not going to do this one. I want to start a different one. And that different one might be um, this one, which a dear friend of mine sent me, uh, which has a cat on it. And, and I like how it went goes all the way around the back to the ball of yarn. Um, so it might be this one, or... It might be this other one that I've had sitting around for a while. This is one of the ones from, this is an Exceed journal from uh, Walmart, right? Yeah, Walmart. And this one has dot grid and off-white paper and uh, nothing special about it. Nobody special sent it to me and I just bought it. It's obviously very plain, just orange and more orange so I don't know um, or maybe it'll be a different one maybe I will for some reason decide I have to buy a new one for this particular next one I don't I don't really know I, I don't I didn't have a clue so anyway this we've been staring at this page this is April 5th and I drew this little elephant head and I don't know, let's see. Today I filled out, addressed, and stamped all the Easter cards and a couple birthday cards I'd previously bought. Well, good for me. You know what? It is after Easter. Easter was the 12th. Today is the 21st. My sister and my nephew still have not gotten their Easter cards from me. And I'm not sure about some other people. Some people have, some people haven't. I don't know why. So, yeah, I don't know. I hope they get them, but the idea was to make their Easter happier, either, even though we're all, you know, basically locked down, quarantine, COVID, blah, blah, blah. I don't care. I'm, so, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm in a really bad mood. So then um, I applied at Amazon. I watched the prerequisite videos. Um, and uh, so there's that. Um... This is a page that quite clearly states, I can't remember my original idea for this page, but it turned into a how many cat washies do I have page. So we'll just go up through them a little bit here. Um, different cat. And then this, um, the cutout here where the brain is with cats in it, um, that was from, I believe it was a Sheba cat food ad that I cut out. Um, 8th of April, um, well, I made this, where I did the, ah, sorry, change is beautiful, and I started, you know, I added something new, like, all the way down until I got to one that had all the cool stuff on it, but I thought it was neat. Anyway, um, my sister ordered me a book, which is really nice of her. And um, I think that's when I made New England baked beans that day. Oh, and I went for a, like a new hire interview thing at Amazon. Uh, I got an Easter card. And then I, so I used some fun washi. And I haven't heard back from Amazon. That was just one day difference though. And then some more just random um, COVID crap. 
and that same day I was all set to write, but now I don't feel like writing anything except I don't feel like writing anything. There you go. What's this? Didn't we just see this? Well, I thought we did. It's very similar to a previous Easter card I got, but not the same. See? Okay, Snoopy as a bunny with eggs and jelly beans. Snoopy as a bunny with eggs and jelly beans, but there's also Woodstock. And this one says, happiness is having someone like you. And then this one says, a wish just for you. So very similar, not the same, and not from the same people. <laughs> this one, I have had this thing forever. So I just scribbled in some color instead of having it black and white. This came, this was a wrapper off a set of two skinny journals, little thin journals that I had gotten. Um, I bought one just to be my my plant diary for gardening and so far I haven't done anything with the other one but since they were a dollar for two of them that's fine oh and I got this thing so you, your your stuff's ready for you know your car's ready for these things and it's not even time to change my oil yet I got it changed last month so I don't know why I have this already but anyway um look lips woo there. I kissed you all. Um, I did finally find some lipstick that I love. I really love this color. It's Flamboyant Flamingo from L'Oreal. So it took me forever. I finally found a lipstick I like. It looks good on me. <gasps> Another Easter card. Oh my gosh, which is cute little darky. Um, that's from my Aunt Kim. And it's one of those neat ones that goes all the way out. So that's nice. And then, what's this? April 10th. Um, it's snowing. Now, this is not, I, I know this looks Easter-ish, which is interesting. It wasn't quite Easter, though. It's a couple days before Easter, but it snowed. And I also got this nice Easter card, a uh, postcard from somebody I don't know. Um, so I added, oh, and I found myself a Russell Stover's dark chocolate bunny, which I ate part of because, you know, I'm the only one who's going to get me anything for Easter, whether this was COVID quarantine or not. So I started eating it. Um, and then you might notice 10th of April. 15th of April, because on actual Easter, I didn't write anything, or do pictures, or anything. Anyway, this is um, our, our governor, um, Governor Tim, and um, it was just a little story about him in a local magazine, so I'll cut that out. 16th, um... I went ahead and I had to go, I, I had to take my niece out to get some stuff at the drugstore. And there's some, a couple of Chinese places right in that area. So we ordered takeout since they're doing curbside delivery. And you could pick your stuff up right outside the front door. So I got some cream cheese wontons and some I'd never had before, pineapple fried rice. And I got tofu in it. And you know what? I really like the fried rice a lot the only complaint I would have is that there was more pieces of pineapple because I love pineapple when it's warm and wow it's just it was really good um oh that's my fortune uh, honest uh, and I'm sorry about the smudges there are smudges all over this page because previous to doing this page I um was cutting out magazine um newspaper articles and gluing them in something else and I just had um newsprint all over myself and I didn't think to wash it off before I started something else because that's me um oh April 17th this paper you can probably tell to this page it's a different color it's a purplish color I actually dyed that piece of paper with carrot water I had blue carrots and it was the first time I ever cooked them. And they um, 
it turns the water as brilliant, beautiful shade of violet, and I couldn't throw it out. So I dyed, I dyed a couple pieces of paper with it. And, uh, it's kind of neat. <laughs> um, and this is my, my drawing of a kind of concerned, sad face. Um, because the soup I made the other day didn't turn out, and I was really kind of bummed. I don't want to waste it, but it, it's not where I want it to be either, so I'm just trying to figure out ways to eat it and try to enjoy it. 18th, this one I took out, this little political type cartoon uh, from a newspaper, but I colored it in so it wasn't just gray, and I kind of like that. I'm going to try that with some different ones. Color in the newspaper thingies. With 63, um, I got some sidewalk chalk. Mosquitoes are coming out. Not happy. They're jet black. I made a list of all my fugglers at that time. I have one more since then. Um, and then I was talking about trying them. Um, a non-bleach way to get the color out of my hair. I haven't done it yet. 19th. We still got... Uh, oh yeah, this is just watercolor. They're supposed to be watercolor crayons that you can color with and then it's supposed to spread the color when you add water, but it didn't spread really. But, well... What can you do? Um... Oh yeah, I covered my one window with hearts. The happy heart hunt. I wrote about mosquitoes again. Little bastards. <laughs> and then yesterday my friend sent me this card. And it's really weird because of the other side of it where the writing is. It's not her writing. It's not her writing at all. The message is wonderful and I can tell she picked out the message but wasn't her writing, so I asked, I called and asked and, uh, well, texted her. And she said she ordered it for me. So I guess you can have, order a postcard and they will write the thing on it for you. So that was neat. But anyways, the mushy friendship one, and it was really, really sweet, and I love it. So of course I stuck it in here, and I made it the focal point of the whole thing, because nothing else yesterday was worth writing about, I guess, so. Um, but what I did here is I put some stickers, that's my friend's name who sent it to me. And then I had, I had all these thingies and this funky ballerina tape, which I will probably never use on anything else. I got it with a set of other washi tape and I just, I don't really use ballerinas in much of anything. So, and then I did this because it's paper airplane. I did it because, I don't know, my idea was like, you write your friend a note and then make it into an airplane and send it to them. Sort of like a card. I don't know. It's being weird. Random donut washi I got from somebody. Oh, and here. Janice is sleeping on my stuff. Excuse me, Janice, honey. I want it. I want this. She's like, I don't care. I'm sleeping. So, <laughs> anyway, so, and that, that's it. I haven't done today's yet. I guess, because today's still going. So, anyway, um... That's all I got. I'm sorry if I sound sad. I'm having a bad day, actually. And I'm trying really, really my hardest not to cry. Again. So, yeah. Um. But I'm going to go. And as I leave you, I will... There's a dog brush. I'm going to let you take a look at my fugglers and go over there. That is um, Ellen. Gary. Uh, that little gray guy is Dorian. The bat in the back is Lucretia. Little blue squirrel with the mustache is Che. This off white one is Nilla Bean. The one behind her is uh, Bruce. The green guy is um, Enzo. This three eyed alien doesn't have a name yet. The one that looks like he's chomping on the three-eyed alien. That's that's my first fuggler I ever got. Um, it's still my favorite, I think. That's Onslow. And then Elizabeth Victoria. 
And then there's a couple that have been hanging out on my bed with me. Hold on just a second. There's Frank. Yeah, Fuzzy Frank. And my newest addition, probably my last one. Um, this guy right here, whose name at the moment is Johnny Bananas, but that may change. Might be Johnny Lemons. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if I want him to have a gangster name. Uh, call him a Lem. Lemons and Lem for sure. I don't know. Anyway, if you gave a shit, those. Are, that's my fucklers. Um. I'm gonna get off here. And we'll see you guys soon. I hope you guys are still journaling or finding things to do to pass the time. Maybe do something silly. Um, this, I don't know if you know about fugglers, but fugglers do not come with their little ears or nodes or whatever pierced. I added those little button earring kind of things. Um, they also don't come with mustaches. Che's mustache is uh, something I did. The bat, you can't quite see her, but she doesn't come that way either. I've, I've made some modifications. I think everybody's going to get a little modification to make them truly mine. Anyway, uh, I'm, I'm babbling, so I'm going to go. Bye-bye.